Today, we're diving into CG Dream, a powerful AI-driven image generation platform. To get started, visit their website at cgdream.ai. Click on Join and log in using your Google, Facebook, or Discord account. Once you're on the homepage, you'll notice a text bar at the bottom. This is where you can describe your vision or explore the gallery for inspiration. Now, let's generate our own artwork. I'll type in a prompt asking for a wolf behind a car. The result looks great, but I want to refine it further. That's where CG Dream's filter system comes in. Let's explore how it works. If I scroll through the available filter categories, I can see a variety of options to enhance the image. I'll choose a few that I think will blend well together. At the bottom, I can also adjust the intensity of each filter to fine tune the final look. Now, here's an exciting feature called Dream Up. Instead of starting from scratch, we can take an existing image and let CG Dream creatively transform it. Let's test this with a gallery image. I'll click on Dream Up and let the AI generate something unique. This new version looks fantastic, but I want a sharper, more detailed version. Here's a simple trick. Just click on the 2X button and you'll instantly get a high resolution upgrade. The difference is incredible. CG Dream also allows you to generate stunning images just by using filters. Click on filters, go to the character category and select anything from animals to mythical creatures. I'll create a samurai by selecting the man realistic filter. Next, I'll head over to abstract and add some dynamic shapes for an artistic touch. Without even typing a prompt, I'll choose three variations and hit Dream Up. And just like that, we've created an amazing image, completely from filters alone. Now, let me introduce you to structure-based generation. For example, let's say we have an image with an amazing composition and layout that we really love. Instead of starting from scratch, we can use this as a structural guide while telling CG Dream to create an entirely different scene based on it. It's super easy to do. Just upload your reference image, adjust how much you want to preserve its original structure, and then describe the new direction you want to take it in. A key part of this process is the strength slider, which determines how closely the AI sticks to the original layout. If set to a high value, the generated image will closely resemble the reference, just with new details. If set lower, the AI has more creative freedom to alter the design while still maintaining some structural similarities. I'll take this fantasy-themed landscape and instruct CG Dream to transform it into a futuristic cyberpunk cityscape. Notice how it maintains the same composition, but the AI completely reinvents the buildings, lighting, and atmosphere to match the cyberpunk aesthetic. This feature works seamlessly with the filters we discussed earlier, so you can refine the output even further, ensuring it matches your vision perfectly. Now, let's talk about another mind-blowing feature. 2D to 3D conversion. I'll take this image and click on the 3D conversion button at the bottom. As you can see, the AI processes the image and automatically generates a 3D model. While it's not always flawless, it dramatically reduces the time and effort needed compared to manually modeling from scratch. For simple objects, the conversion works almost perfectly. For more complex subjects, it still provides a solid starting point which you can refine further using other 3D modeling tools. Now, let me introduce you to one of the most impressive features of CG Dream, face transformation. This tool is an absolute game changer because it allows you to take any photo of a person and place them into an entirely new scene while keeping their likeness intact. When you upload a photo, you'll notice a slider that controls how much of the original face is preserved. If you set it to 100%, the AI will try to keep the face identical to the original. But if you lower the percentage, CG Dream will take more creative liberties, altering facial features while still maintaining some resemblance. I'll upload a photo of my friend and test out different settings. First, I'll keep the character strength at 100% and type in a prompt, a medieval knight in shining armor, standing in a grand castle. And here it is. CG Dream has placed him perfectly in this historical setting while keeping his face exactly as it is in real life. Now, let's push it a bit further. This time, I'll reduce the character strength and enter a new prompt. Now, look at the result. The AI has reimagined his facial features slightly, making them blend seamlessly into this theme while still maintaining a recognizable resemblance. 
Let's switch things up and try something new. This time, I'll enter another prompt with my face. And just like that, CG Dream. My facial features are still clearly recognizable, but everything else, the background, outfit, and overall atmosphere, has been completely transformed. If the first result isn't exactly what you envisioned, don't stop there. Try generating three or four variations. Sometimes, the first attempt might not fully capture your idea, but by the third or fourth variation, you'll likely get the perfect version of what you were aiming for. Now, let me introduce you to another feature I use all the time, in painting. If you've generated an image and you want to change one small detail, then you can do it with CG Dream. Instead of regenerating the entire image, it allows you to select only the part you want to fix and make changes while leaving the rest untouched. Let me show you an example. Say I have this AI-generated image, and I love the composition, but one element feels off. Instead of starting from scratch, I can simply hover over that section, highlight it, and tell CG Dream exactly what I want to replace it with. I'll select this small object right here and decide to transform it into something more magical. I just type in my change, click In Paint, and let CG Dream do the rest. Within seconds, the AI has seamlessly blended the new object into the scene while keeping everything else exactly the same. One of the best things about in-painting is that you're not limited to just one edit per image. You can actually apply multiple in-painting adjustments on the same image. However, there's one important step you need to remember. Erase your previous in-painting selection before making a new change. This ensures that each edit is applied independently, allowing the AI to make seamless adjustments without interfering with earlier modifications. Let's say I've already fixed one section of my image, but now I want to adjust another detail. All I need to do is select the new area I want to modify and repeat the in-painting process. CG Dreams A. I will make sure that each new change blends smoothly with the rest of the image, maintaining a natural and cohesive look. I would recommend you to always select a slightly larger area than you think you need, because this gives the AI more room to blend the changes seamlessly into the existing image, making the transition appear much more natural. If your selection is too small, you might end up with harsh edges or mismatched details. But here's where it gets even better. You can combine in-painting with CG Dreams filters for an even more polished final result. After you've finished tweaking parts of your image, you can still apply filters to enhance the overall style and create a cohesive look. For this edit, I decided to mix several filters, including epic environment, battle fantasy, and organic abstract art. The result? A perfectly blended, highly stylized masterpiece where every element looks like it belongs. If you're enjoying this type of content, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update. I've got plenty more exciting videos coming your way, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.